Welcome back. Rich Abney joins us now with sports, and there's a great event going on in town this weekend. There is, yeah. Thank you, Aileen. Thanks very much. It's a tradition that's been going on for nearly 20 years. The Aboriginal community gets together for an annual hockey tournament to celebrate the game and their culture. Today marks the opening of this year's tournament, and the weekend is sure to be filled with fun, finesse, and fellowship. This weekend, 34 teams will take the ice for the annual Aboriginal hockey tournament in Prince George. The event has been going on for nearly two decades. They've seen the need to have an Aboriginal tournament for the youth, um, so it's been around 18 years and we're just trying to carry on the event to make sure that the Aboriginal youth have a place to play the game. The purpose of the tournament was to build fellowship among Aboriginal youth. A lot of Aboriginal youth play on different teams throughout the year, so it brings the kids together, creates some friendships, uh, it allows uh, those friendships to be created and, and provides a long-lasting friendship throughout you know, their lifetime. Among the 30-plus teams, there are a variety of age groups. Some of the teams come as a unit. Some play together for the first time at the tournament. The teams are kind of just put together by individual groups. Uh, some of the First Nation communities bring their own teams. Uh, the Prince George teams, uh, most of them are local players. In the years past, there's been teams coming from Alberta and Saskatchewan. So, um, you know, it's, it's a real mixture of uh, Aboriginal kids. Keith Henry coaches novice, and he's been involved for a number of years. For him, it's a chance to carry on a legacy. We try to ensure that we respect the traditional territory of Clay Litane, and so, so we have a welcoming come from, coming from the chief, uh, Chief Dominic Frederick. It is important for the tournament organizers that the Aboriginal culture is respected and will be prominent in Friday's opening ceremonies. For me, it's just about giving back, being able to carry on the legacy that those have provided uh, in the past. For me, to be able to give back and to provide and continue their legacy.